We get some Chinese after this. Yeah. Yay! I'll turn toffee. What? Alright. Maybe we can do that evil in between the Chinese coming to Sunday 15 if you it. Then we'll have to do some we'll 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 TD afterwards. Yeah. Uh, and if we feel like we've got the Magni, the UD, DD, 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 DD. 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 Yeah, come on, let's do it. <laughs> let's do it and then make right, faces. I can't help myself, Minjina. Hey guys, welcome to another one of our reviews. I'm the Worm, this is the Proton. Uh, today we're doing another juice review which you did receive for your charge. Uh, this will not affect our review in any way, shape, or form. Lightning speed today. <laughs> la, 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 la. Uh, we did receive the uh, juices from John at e uk, but you can also use .net if you're on a mobile or tablet device. So, thumbs up for that. Indeed. Um, as Worm's being sloppy, we did receive his free of charge. I did change review. Well, in which case I'm doing it again anyway, just to prove <laughs> it. It's not going to change review. <laughs> the review will not change. It will be the same. Um, <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm on the moods, guys. Um, right, what we're doing today is um, RY6 uh, from e uk. I'm going to have a vape. Worm's going to have for that free change. Just on the bottle, so I can I'll give you all the bottles. All the bottles. All the bottles. We've got this on an M6 stripper on a Chew clone. Look at it, it's so sexy. Um, <laughs> one uncle ish. Yeah. Um, yeah, as we said, it's uh, RI6. We've got been 18, 12, and 24. They do come with uh, tactile and chip compliant labels on them. They are child proof. Uh, you haven't got the uh, the big needle tops that you do normally get from John, but we're just. We're assuming that they'll probably be coming sometime in the future, not a guarantee, but we're assuming this is just like stocks because obviously it's a big uh, selling flavour, you get a load of stock in and this is what he's got, got to run through his stocks before he gets the other stuff. Uh, so yeah, but they do come with the little nipples like that, so you're still good for like putting in your drippers or filling up other stuff that's obviously you've got like a little fill hole or whatever, so they will still do the job. Uh, we have got three guys in the box, so we've got three different juices, this is a 24 minute drink. Yeah, it's starting on 24. Same juice with different drinks. But yeah, chip and line tactile labels and all that, all good stuff. All that good stuff. Um, right, RY6, so as you don't know, anything RY um, is a tobacco caramel or a tobacco with a caramel sweetness on, on the after. Higher the number, the sweeter it's meant to be. Um, and that is a 24 milligram strength juice. For me, I'm getting a, it's, it, we've just done the RY5, um, and to be honest, I'm getting a very, very similar tobacco that I was getting in that. It's a strongish tobacco, um, definitely reminds me more of a traditional tobacco cigarette as opposed to a rolling uh, tobacco cigarette. Um, uh, one that I'm strong to put it, a mulga red or something like that, that's, kind of, that's the kind of cigarette taste I'm getting from it. In terms of sweetness, it's not super sweet. It's I'm getting a very, very slight sweetness kind of, not right at the back of my mouth, but nearly at the back of my mouth. It's kind of it's lingering slightly. It's basically gone now, but just a, a, a touch of sweetness and quite a strong tobacco. Um, yeah, definitely a tobacco vape, guys. Obviously, that our ways are meant to be predominantly tobacco with us. A hint of sweetness. Obviously, the foam gun scale, like Mr. Brown said, you get more sweetness. Uh, I'm actually getting more than I did from the RY5. That's what you should be getting, really. Isn't it? Yeah. So it's what you'd expect, but I think this is about 50/50 on the tobacco and the sweetness, which is. Um, it's actually, quite, it's actually quite nice. Mm. For 24, this is, I'm getting zero throat hit from this. And please bear in mind, guys, that I don't generally get throat anyway, but I do normally get a nicotine throat touch, twi twinge sort of thing. Not getting it at all on this. The sweetness is coming up very nicely on this, and um, the, I could quite happily vape this. The even after being on. The was hitting harder. Than yeah, that. I could feel that. I could feel the nicotine on my throat, but it wasn't like a throat hit, like a kick in the throat or anything. It was just, I could feel it. But uh, this, nothing. Uh, a zero for throw here on this I'm getting and I throw sixes and twelves and this is actually quite nice I hate tobaccos <laughs> this is quite nice there you go um, I do agree with um, the throat hit on this. Uh, it's, I'm, I'm, I'm getting a throat hit because I'm like, well, I have a throat. Um, <laughs> but it's, uh, it is definitely not what I would expect from a 24 milligram strength juice. And I've just undone my button in my mod. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> honestly, guys. Honestly, if you was expecting a professional review, please, please don't subscribe to this channel. Um, right, that's that. Out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> We'll move Very on random. to the. We'll move on to the. Um, 18? The eighteen. Yeah, this is uh, again one in, one uncle uh, on a K one hundred. Uh, all of these are fresh charged batteries for the So eighteen. Yeah, uh, guys, these are six fifty in the range. Uh, the, all the premium ranges are six fifty for a thirty mil bottle and delivered for a pound. 
So that is always good and uh, as long as you get it in before the uh, delivery cut off time you will get these generally next day because John is very on the ball with uh, his delivery and he does like good service so if you are running low and you need a 30 mil bottle he's a place, place to see for cheap. Place to see for cheap. For cheap good e-liquid. <laughs> <laughs> Recovered it. Recovered. Um, like a pro. 18. Ooh, um, for me Pretty much exactly the same as the 24, but I'm getting, it's strange, I'm actually getting slightly less sweetness off this one, slightly more of the tobacco left in my mouth. When I'm vaping it, it's about 50-50 mix, but actually, once I've stopped, I'm getting slightly more tobacco left and slightly less um, sweetness from the caramel, if you like. Uh, the reason we do test all these liquid liquids in different strengths is just to check for consistency. The flavour still tastes the same, it's just the nicotine would affect the take on the flavour, especially um, when each person's take on the flavour would be different as well, but for me, Slightly more tobacco on the tongue, but it tastes the same as a 24 when I'm inhaling it. Yeah, I, got, I kind of got to agree there. It's definitely, a, it's only very slight more tobacco on the tongue. The sweetness is still there, exactly the same. But the, the tobacco is sitting on your tongue a little bit more on this. And um, even afterwards, I'm getting less of like 50-50 or like both. More of like just the tobacco left. And that being said, it's not a bad tobacco in this. I mean, it's, it's the same, it's very similar to the... RY5 that we just reviewed and um, I, I, I can't explain it but the tobacco in this just seems tastier if, if that makes any sense. It's, um, it's a bit of sweetness when it, it it's, it's going to be the sweetness but it's just oh. I'm actually enjoying the tobacco. I don't hate it. I, it doesn't hate it. Don't come much higher than that to be honest you guys from in for tobaccos. I, I could quite happily vape this. It's, just, um, it's a weird one. It's, it's firing me a curveball this RY6. There you go. Um, we'll move on to the uh, 12. 12, 12, 12, 12 milligram, milligram strength. Uh, again, one ohm, M6, drip bar on a V3 mechanical. You done PGV you reckon? Oh no, I didn't. Uh, uh, PG Stop. ratio, we're not exact on this because uh, Hang Seng tailor their PG, PG ratio to their flavours, uh, but they're generally between 70 and 90% PG. We don't know exactly where because they don't tell you. They just are around that mark. That's all we got when we tried querying them and about it, and then that's all we could get from any kind of sources like searching around. They vary them to tailor to their juices, which is a good thing in my opinion. But maybe they could maybe open the market to a higher VG for people out there. But that's working for them. So it is what it is. So if you're one of the people that don't like high PG juices, guys, they're not for you. Um, <clears> the <throat> twelve. Uh, it's, it's actually, for, in terms of like the, the take on the taste for me, it's actually in between the 24 and the 18, so I'm getting a little bit more tobacco than I was from the 24, but a little less than the 18, and I'm getting a little bit more sweetness than I was from the 18, but a little bit less than the 24, um, but obviously the throat has come down a little bit more because it's a 12, so that is what it is, for me it tastes exactly the same, but it's just the, the take on it, the nicotine affects the take for, for us anyway, and obviously our taste can be different to yours guys, we're just trying to give you an idea of what it's supposed to taste like out of the bottle. Yeah, it's um same taste. I suppose I'm getting more of like the 50-50 that we got on the 24, so it's more the sweetness and tobacco blended a little bit better on this for whatever reason and um, none of that uh, tobacco left on my tongue, it's more of a sweetness on this one on my tongue left afterwards but the taste on the inhale and exhale is similar to the 24 where it's kind of a mixture of both. Um, it's quite nice actually, again zero throw here, but then again I was getting none off the other two so I wouldn't expect any of the 12, if I'm honest. Um, yeah, it's actually um, not bad juice at all. There you go. And um, we do two marks out of ten, one for what it's supposed to taste like, as in whether it tastes like what it should, um, out of the bottle, and then one what our personal take on it is. Pay attention to the first one, our personal take is going to be different to yours guys. Yeah, it's just so you get a reflection of... If you don't like these all juices but you want to try them anyway, you kind of get what you wear, you kind of see an ish. So if you're one of our regular subs as well, if you if you've bought a few of these juices, you've got our marks on them and your marks are fairly similar, you can kind of guesstimate that if we give something a high mark, you're probably going to like it um, based on our taste cross-referencing with yours. Right guys, it's RI6, it's meant to be a tobacco with a sweetness more than the other previous in the range because it's a high number. So is it true to its name? Yes, they all are. They are a tobacco with a sweetness in there. Um, they're all tens for what they're meant to be. They just are. Um, yeah, for me, I'm going to match that exactly the same. Slightly sweeter than the RY5, as you'd expect it to be. So caramelised tobacco, lovely stuff. It's a ten. Yeah. Uh, for me personally, on the 24, quite like the 24. I really do actually. I mean, I didn't expect I would, 
but this RA6 is throwing me a curveball and the 24 I'm going to say it's a 9. That is extremely high for a tobacco for me, extremely high. I mean, I've given the RY5s quite high marks. This has just improved it even more. It's a 9. Uh, the 18, not so much on the 18. Yeah, this That weird taste left on my tongue with the tobacco um, kind of knocks it down to about a 7 for me. I mean, it's still vapable. I mean, I'd use it on a night out quite happily, but as an all-day vape for me, not saying that I would go to. It would be like back of the queue. Um, so, yeah, about a 7 for the 18. For the 12, more like the um, 24, I could use that if I needed to. I mean, it would be a juicer that would sit around happily and I would, if I was running out, use that. Um, and that's say 9 as well for the 12. But the 12 would be more of like using it as and when I need to, whereas the 24 would be more of a drinking vape because you want more nicotine when you're drinking. Um, for me, I'm going to go opposite, I'm going to go small to big. The 12, I'm going to give it a 7. I think the 12 is quite nice, um, but I do prefer one of the other strengths. Uh, the 18 for me, I'm going to give that, I'm going to give it a 6. I'm not a big fan of the 18. Like that, the, the, the nicotine just takes a little bit, the edge off, uh, and the edge it takes is the one that I like, unfortunately. Um, the 24 is getting a 9.5. I actually could vape that 24 all day. I mean, don't wrong, I couldn't vape it as much as I usually vape because it's 24, but I could use it as an all-day vape quite happily and it wouldn't bother me at all. Um, so yeah, I, I agree with well this. It's a bit of a weird one for us to like a tobacco this much. And such a high strength as well. Yeah, we don't, I mean, I'll vape 18s if the flavor's good, but 24 is very rare that I'd pick up a 24 fruit choice. Um, but that, that RY6 is actually very nice. Obviously guys, if you're buying your nicotine strength based on what you're usually using, the throat hit stuff is going to be irrelevant to you, but yeah. There you go. It is what it is. Um, I believe these are coming in lower strengths as well, guys. I believe John's getting all of these juices in a six. He's pretty much getting all of his juices in a six. Um, he's starting to send a few of those out to us as well, uh, which is good if you are looking to reduce or if you're looking to a, a lower nicotine strength. Not bad. Or, or eventually give up. Indeed. Or if you bought a 24 and it's a bit too much for you, buy a six. Mix them. Lovely. There you go. You can meet in the middle, can't you? Yeah. Um, right, guys. That is pretty much it. Thank you for watching. I've been Mr. Proton. It's been the worm. See you soon.